here's a quick little video for anybody who's maybe in school, studying, whatever. It's super simple. Well, it's simple stuff for people that have been doing it forever, but sometimes these concepts can be difficult to really grasp. So at this point in whatever your journey is, I would like to think that you can calculate interior and exterior angles based off of the information given in a drawing such as this one. Um, but let's say somebody asks you to calculate the deflection angle um, if you are sitting at F, M to W. So you're back sighting M, for sighting W. What exactly is it asking you? It's obviously not asking you for this angle here because this is given. It's not asking you for this because that's completing, that's, this is just the exterior angle of F. We want the deflection angle. So the best way to visualize this is to think about your line of sight from the back sight. So let's say you're, it's, it's just going to extend straight out from F. Now, if you draw this, drawing things can be really helpful. <laughs> draw this like this. You don't want to calculate the entirety of this. This is the entire exterior angle of F. If you look at this as this straight line extending out from M, you can see clearly if you're looking at this as a whole circle, that this is half of the circle. This is 180 degrees. We have the interior angle of F, so this is the angle that we want to calculate. So all you're going to do is take 180 degrees and subtract the rest of, of the interior angle here from the circle. 93, 18, 45. This is going to give us an answer of 86, 86, 40, 41, 15. And you can double check yourself by seeing that this is just less than a 90 degree angle, which makes sense and it checks. Hopefully that helps.